We have video of you feeding Kyle's father to a starved and desperate alien. Now what are you gonna do with it? Expose the truth. I don't think so. I don't think you'd do that to Michael Garrett. He wouldn't. I would. You've been avoiding me. Well, I learned you and all of our friends have been lying to me about aliens and murders and resurrections, so haven't been feeling particularly social. That being said, I fell for your ex. So I've decided even though I'm still not speaking to them, you and I are even. That's fair. How come you're not mad at me? For Michael, uh, the mess between us will never be your fault. And plus, you didn't know my history with him until after you hooked up. That's my fault. I should have told you. No, when I found out, I should have stopped. I... Yeah, okay, you should have. But you couldn't. How could I be mad at you for falling for Michael Guerin? It's the easiest thing in the world. <laughs> yeah, until it's not. Don't write him off yet, okay? He keeps secrets because of how much he loves Max and Isabel, not because of how much he loves you. You told me once that you would stay in Roswell forever if the guy from the museum would just keep kissing you, but you did leave. What happened? That summer, Garen stopped being that guy. <clears throat> I begged him to get it together. Then he got busted for stealing hubcaps, something like that. He was pushing you away. He does that. He hurts people to see if they let him go. Made out with Lindsay right in front of me. Yeah, well, I didn't need much pushing. He had become this walking bar fight, and I just could not deal. Hey, you grew up in an abusive home. It makes sense that you didn't want to be around all that anger. Yeah, and then the irony of enlisting to escape violence. He was locked up the day that I left. I didn't get to say goodbye. You can answer that. No, it's okay. Hey, why don't you bring him along? The guy has actual superpowers. I have one good leg. Yeah. Michael is destructive. He starts fights, lies. He lied to protect his family from my family. No, I dated a guy like that. His name was Chad. He shouldered the burden of a murder he didn't commit for 10 years so that Isabel didn't have to. And he pushed you away because he was trying to protect you. And honestly, maybe he was right. I mean, he has a lot of baggage. But he's not a Chad. What happens when I stop being mad at Michael Guerin? To you and me. Nothing. I would never stop loving you. Greg, you mind taking me back to the trading post? I think I should check on Alex and Maria. I mean, seriously, Alex or Maria? What'd you do with Alex? Where the hell's Alex? I don't know. That's what I'm doing here. I'm looking for him. Try again. You told Alex Tripp gave you this in 1987. That's before the crash. I never used this logo. You lied to get Alex to recover the piece of alien tech from me. What did you do with him once he had it? I just found out Alex never made it to Andrews Air Force Base last week. He's disabled. He's got PTSD. So I'm concerned about him. Your kinder, gentler, bigot scumbag thing isn't gonna work with me. Without even touching you, I can rip your trachea out and show it to you. For once, we're on the same side. We both want Alex back. So yeah, go ahead, lose your only lead. Or you could let me help you find him. What'd you do with your brother? Where is Alex? He's safe and sound. I know how concerned you are about his safety. Isn't that why you had him locked in the basement? You kidnapped him first, Pops. What do you want from him anyway? You're gonna hand him over to me right now. You had him in your basement? Well, you took him last week after you got that piece of alien tech from me? 
He's a loose end. If we got him back from Flint, you were gonna kill him. You are barely human! Ooh, when I was a kid, I thought maybe because my high IQ, my, my species, was superior to yours. And I fell in love with your son. And I didn't feel superior anymore. I am angry. And smashing things, it's easy. Alex has evolved past that. He's past you. And he's past me. Despite you, you slapping him around, shoving that mains man crap down his throat, he still loves. He even loves you. You don't deserve to call him your son.